Beast Box Battles. The Beast Box Battles, my um, new genre video, I covered Bioboxix, what that was. So watch that other video to kind of catch up on what Bioboxix or BioBeat genre is. So this, this is kind of a stem off of that. With hip hop and beatboxing and rap, there are freestyle battles. Um, where you improvise on the stage or you do your drum set against one side. Someone does drums, someone does drums. You know, you have a little battle going on. I can't simulate it very well with my hands, but that's the exchange. The go-between between two beatboxers. Exchange of sounds or words between another MC or another beatboxer and another beatboxer. And so there's an exchange of words or exchange of sounds or even a combo. Well, bio beats, bio beat battles. You got one guy chirping at another guy doing roars, barks, back and forth, and nature will decide. So what are the rules of beast box battles? The beast, first of all, beast box battling is beasts, like animals. Box represents the beatboxing. Well, there's different rules for this than there is regular beatbox battles. With beast box battles, it's only animal sounds by voice. There's two people, there can be groups, there can be, you know, there can be looping battles. But for this one, we just got one-on-one, -on -one, mano a mano, you know, hand to hand, mouth to mouth, boca a boca. So we got one guy doing this set of sounds, and then goes back and forth. So they each are given, you know, 30 seconds, a minute, minute and a half, two minutes. You know, you get rounds, and the nature will decide. So, so the, it's only animal sounds. So what does that exclude? Drum sounds. No drum sounds. No drum sounds, no turntable sounds, and no words. So the, the typical modes of boxing and rap are left out. And it's just a single layer. You don't have to use a mic. You can use a mic, but the setting has to be in nature. <laughs> the setting has to be in nature, and you can have a crowd of people, but this is an unheard of ta territory. If you want to see a actual, if you want to see a beast box battle, the first one ever, check out this video over here or there. Um, I'll leave a, leave a link. Um, the first beast box battle ever, shot in Minnesota. So you have your crowd is nature, it decides. Or you can have a group of people cheering on. But you gotta be quiet for beast box battles because there's usually no speakers. You may not you may have to travel a long distance to get to where you may have to hike up into a ridge or you may have to go deep in the woods. There's it's it's like a backpacking type of thing. You have to travel. You can use cameras, you can record the stuff, but there probably won't be at this park that I'm at right now, there is no power. So just saying you might not have electricity to amp it up with sound equipment but feel free to take videos now there are currently none of these battles going on so this is a thing for me i implore you whoever is watching this to pick up as many animal sounds as you can on this channel two sounds at once there are a, a grip full of them i encourage you to acquire some of these sounds. Have a friend acquire, maybe a couple friends. Practice with each other. Listen to animal sounds out in nature and battle with each other. Film your battles. If you do this, please let me know. If you think this is something that you wanna try, if you wanna try a beast box battle, I'm not gonna, I probably won't battle anyone. I'm just not a battler, but then again, I might. I don't know, there's some fierce competition out there, or is there? Being able to do a beast box battle would be pretty cool. So leave your comments below. Uh, also check out my uh, new album, Hypnotic Beatboxing, Volume 1. There is going to be more of them. And check out Tripped Out Pond. It's a, a bio beat, bio box genre album. And uh, if you watch this video this far, 
maybe you could choose to subscribe if you haven't already. If you are ambivalent, watch some of my other videos and make a decision about it. Thank you guys. I appreciate it. Peace.